Let's turn our attention now to a crucial discovery. The supermassive black hole at the center of our galaxy is the undisputed heavyweight champion of the Milky Way. But newly spotted object takes the crown for the most massive stellar black hole known in our galaxy, weighing at an impressive 33 times the mass of our sun. Astronomers have detected the largest stellar black hole with a mass 33 times that of the Sun in the Milky Way galaxy. It's also the second closest black hole to Earth, sitting about 2,000 light years away from the planet. A stellar black hole is formed when a star collapses, and so far, the ones found in our galaxy have actually been about 10 times as big as the Sun in terms of just mass. But fun fact for you, the serendipitous discovery is so important that scientists released details of the object earlier than planned to enable other astronomers to perform further observations as soon as possible. On the World 24-7, we have Timo Prusty joining us. Thank you so much, Mr. Prusty, for making time for us on NDTV. Timo Prusty is actually the project scientist for Gaia and at the European Space Agency. That's where he's working. He joins us live from the Netherlands. This is actually the first time such a big black hole of stellar origin has been discovered in the Milky Way. So talk to us about the process behind making this discovery using the European Air Space Agency's data. So the, the detection is made uh, with the Gaia satellite. And uh, it is actually not a surprise that we will see something like black holes uh, because uh, what Gaia is very good in observing is uh, tiny little, little wobbles of stars in their path on the sky. And in this case, what was uh, discovered is that the, there is a star which seems to be wobbling around something which we don't see at all. So it's like wobbling around emptiness and then you do all the calculations and you come out uh, to the conclusion that the only possibility is that there is a black hole which is invisible in the light but it the gravitation uh, is uh, is causing the other star to to wobble around this black hole but mr Prusi, help us understand what does this discovery mean for us how we how do we understand and explore stars now on Well, actually, uh, it's more like uh, indication what we don't understand. The theoretical models don't really anticipate that this kind of black holes could uh, exist. And it has been a puzzle because there has been uh, recently uh, gravitational wave detections which indicate from other galaxies that they are caused by black holes of this mass about 30 times more massive than our sun. But all the black holes which have, we have seen in our Milky Way galaxy in totally different method, they are not as heavy. So it is important to confirm that, yes, we have to really correct our theoretical models to understand how these massive black holes, stellar black holes, can actually form. Well, science is all about falsification end of the day. But Mr. Prusi, what makes this black hole discovery different to the ones we have made earlier? What makes this discovery unique? It, uh, it uh, kind of connects two totally different observational methods. So the gravitational waves have uh, uh, demonstrated that we have black holes in other galaxies which are very massive. We knew that in our galaxy there are still are black holes which are not as massive. And now the importance of this one is saying that, yes, it's, it's nothing strange. We do have in our galaxy also this kind of black holes, what we see in totally other methods in other galaxies. So it's confirm, it's like a confirmation that, yes, this category of black holes truly exist. And does this black hole pose any threat to our galaxy? No problem at all, actually. It is just uh, like mass. So the other star is just happily going around this black hole without noticing it anymore at all. And it's, uh, I mean, the comparison is maybe uh, bad. It's like we are going around the sun and we will never, sun is not a threat to us. Uh, the similar way, the black hole is not a threat to the star which is going around it, nor the rest of the galaxy. Right. And what is your team going to do now with this crucial discovery? What are the next steps? 
Well, this was uh, the discovery was made actually as part of the data processing. And in principle, we don't release these kind of results early on because the aim is that it's the worldwide astronomical community who studies this phenomena. However, this we considered so important result that we wanted to bring it immediately to the attention of the whole scientific community. But most of the, the follow-up, we really leave it to the community that, okay, we, this is a very peculiar case, and I'm sure there will, be, there will be a lot of theoretical work, people trying to do models, and there are a lot of people will go to other kind of observational methods. But that one we leave to the community. Well, Mr. Prussi, as we wrap, could you explain to our viewers how will this black hole help us in better understanding other black holes that have been discovered in the past? Uh, the, the importance is that uh, we really understand that there is a population of uh, black holes in, in our galaxy. So uh, with the Gaia satellite, we can detect them uh, as long as they are close to an other star, because otherwise you don't see the black hole. So we need the other star to wobble, which we can see. Uh, so it indicates that it, it is becoming more and more like common to understand that, yes, our Milky Way galaxy have these black holes, which have been so far pretty invisible, and they are there just like normal stars uh, with, uh, with us. Right, black holes of this type have only been discovered in very distant galaxies, as Mr. Prosti has highlighted, and this new discovery challenges scientific ideas about how massive stars come about and grow. Thank you so much, Seema Prosti, for making time for us on NDTV. Really appreciate it.